currently the lowest amount you can deposit on your Skrill account is $1.06 and a lot of you have been asking me to test all these virtual dollar cards if they can deposit on Skrill so what I did was I funded the four that I normally use and I'm going to test them one by one now I have high doubts that any of them will work but anything is possible I sometimes like it when I'm wrong especially if what I'm wrong about is going to benefit a lot of people so having virtual dollar cards that can work with Skrill it's going to help out a lot of people but just in case any of the dollar cards do not work just know that the way i normally fund my skrill account is through my uba dollar debit card i've made a video about how to get it so you can watch it i'll leave a link to it in the description if you want to watch it so in case any of these virtual dollar cards do not work or all of them do not even work then i'll suggest getting the uba dollar debit card i don't know about the prepaid card but the dollar debit card has worked for me so yeah that's what i would recommend all right let's begin so the first virtual dollar card i'm going to test is going to be gray and as you can see i have 4.61 dollars on it and i'm going to try it with just two dollars because the thing about skrill is that if you want to deposit two dollars then you're going to have to add something as their fees i wish they could just remove the fees from the amount you're depositing but anyways that's how it works so i just click deposit and i selected um, credit card or debit card and now i'm going to click add card I'm going to fill up the details then i'll get back to the video okay so i filled up the information for the card this is for gray and i'm going to click add card and continue so it's asking me how much i want to deposit i'll just put two dollars and um, do you want this money to be available even though i'm not going to be using it for anything like gambling i'll select yes because i've heard that oh it says money added with this card can't be used on gambling sites so i'll just select no but if you can then use yes because you'll be able to use the money anyway that's what i've heard at least so click continue okay so with their fees it's going to be five cents which is not too bad so i'll click here to confirm to see if it will work <laughs> it actually worked so gray actually did work which is nice i used to have three dollars here but now it is five so yeah you can use gray virtual dollar card to work on Skrill. I actually doubted that this would work. I'm amazed, so I'm glad I was wrong. All right, let's try GeekPay. Okay, we are currently on GeekPay and this is my virtual dollar card. And you can see this is the one I just did with gray, which worked. So now I'm going to click deposit and uh, I'll click deposit now. So I have two cards now that work. Now I'm going to click add card. And then I'm going to copy all the details as usual. Okay, so I've added the info for GeekPay. Now I'm going to click Save Card again and Add Card and Continue. As you can see, I have $5 here. So I'm just going to input 2 as well and Continue. Finally, I'll click Confirm. This one also worked. So now I have $7 in my main balance. Gray and GeekPay work with Skrill. So if you have those accounts, you can start using them next i'm going to test clasher and cheaper cash but the problem with cheaper cash right now is that their services are down so i'm not sure if this video is going to be uploaded now or maybe in a few days time after they are done so if those two do not work then i'll make a part two but then yeah let's try clasher and see well it turns out that i cannot use clasher with my computer so i have to use my phone and uh, as you can see i have it on my phone let me just show you guys so you can see this is clash on my phone okay you can see it on the screen so all i have to do is just tap show details and now i can copy the numbers and deposit on screen so now i'm going to switch back to my computer click deposit now add card now i have three cards this is going to be the fourth one so when i'm done filling all the info i'll get back to the video okay so this is a visa type of card the other three are mastercard so this is where i'm starting to doubt that it will work but let's try it and see two dollars finally i'll click confirm or well, this time an otp has been sent to my device so let me just type out the number click submit yeah this one said transaction failed so well clasher and cheaper cash are having issues they sent notifications this morning so for now i'm just going to end this video as a part one and then in the future i'll create a part two as soon as they are able to fix their issues then i'll make a part two of this video so you guys can see if you can use clasher and cheaper cash on screen but if you cannot wait for those ones then you can start using GeekPay or gray and um, if you have questions you can leave them in the comments concerning this video please because i see people asking questions from other videos you can ask me questions on those other videos 
and I'll respond to you over there. It doesn't have to be like you want to ask questions in my newest videos that are not related to the videos. But anyways, that's all for this video. Hopefully you guys found it helpful. I haven't asked for likes or subscribers in a long time. So if you want to like the video, please do. If you want to subscribe, look around the channel to see if this is what you like. Check out all my other videos and if you like them, then this is going to be the right place for you. But give this video a like if you found it helpful. And uh, yeah, I'll be seeing you in the next video.